The troubles continue for the company with CEO Mark Zuckerberg taking out ads to apologize for the misuse of user data. Those ads in nine major newspapers. We have one of them right here. Uh, there are also new calls for regulation of social media companies in general. We bring in Melissa Armo of Stock Swoosh to discuss, you know, Melissa, I mean, $75 billion in Facebook's market cap was wiped out last week. This is a big, big issue for them. It was a big issue for them, and I don't think it's over. Right now, Facebook technically is a short. It broke 160, which was a really difficult area on Friday, and I think it's just lower, and I don't think their problems are over. I think they waited way too long to respond. It was about three days till Mark Zuckerberg talked about everything and till he gave an interview, and I just don't think the stock liked that he waited. I think overall they found out that they knew that this happened. They had gotten the information, and they never disclosed it. Some analysts are talking about what's called, and this is a quote, uh, systemic mismanagement at the company that, that's been overlooked. How do you feel about that? Are you, do you expect to see a change in, in the structure of Facebook, particularly at the top? Well, I think they're going to have to do something, particularly if he ends up going in front of Congress. He, what is he going to say? What are they going to do? Right now, if you are have any apps on Facebook, you probably don't even realize it, but you've allowed access to your information to all of those apps. I went in this morning, actually. I've allowed access to 35 apps I didn't even know about. Little tiny things in there, not just my LinkedIn and Twitter, but other things, too. And the problem is when you want to delete one, if you, you go into settings and you can go into apps, to delete them. And I tell everybody, go ahead and do that right now this morning, unless it's something like Twitter or LinkedIn yeah. that you need. But you're allowing access to these other places to get your information. And people probably didn't realize that. I didn't realize that. The apology ads address that. And this comes from that ad. He writes, we're also investigating every single app that had access to large amounts of data before we fix this. We, the we, yeah. yeah. So, so the apps are an issue, but look, the, the apps and the advertising, this is how Facebook makes their money. So if we see heightened regulation, and I just want to bring up that the, the CEO of Apple and IBM are speaking about profound change being needed when we regulate social media companies. This this could hurt Facebook monetarily because it's they definitely going to definitely going to because that's where how do they make money? They make money with ads. So does Google. So does YouTube. Yeah. This is going to affect all of them. I'm surprised actually Tim Cook said that because obviously Apple makes money on ads too. So I was surprised to read that article. But the fact is that they have to do something. I'm not big on regulation, but I am big on privacy. Yeah. Melissa, thank you very much. Good to see you. Thanks.